I just came back from Uncle Bob's General Store in Ludlow, Massachusetts, and I picked out some great, great Portuguese wines to go with today's meal. Today's meal is a caldeirada. Caldeirada is a fish stew where we have three different types of fish, and also we throw some clams in it to round it off and, and uh, make it a, into a delicious meal. The wines that I picked out are three wines from the northern region of Portugal. Two are of the Vinho Verde variety. Vinho Verde is a very unique wine that's very well loved in Portugal. Uh, they even make folk songs about it. It comes from the north of Portugal in a very uh, protected wine growing region of Portugal. Amongst the, the wineries there is a winery of Avaleda. Avaleda makes some great, great Vinho Verde and I have three wines from their winery here today. The first one is Quinta de Avaleda. Quinta de Avaleda is a blend of some old world grapes that are still grown in Portugal. Among those are Trajadura, uh, Loreiro, Rinto, and Azal. Uh, those are three old, uh, four old world grape varieties still being grown in Portugal and used in making of the Vinho Verde. This is a great, great wine for you to try out. It goes great with today's meal. It has a uh, uh, a spritzer-like feel to it when you drink it, almost like a champagne uh, uh, effect on your tongue, and it's a nice crispy white wine that'll go great with this meal. In keeping with Vinho Verde, I have another variety here, also from Avaleda. This one is the uh, Alvarinho. And it's so-called Alvarinho because it is made from another old grape variety called the Alvarinho grape. Another grape pretty unique to Portugal and, they, and, and very popular and uh, arguably probably the best Vinho Verde uh, grape that is used in making uh, of, of this wine. Again, it has a, a spritzer-like flavor uh, uh, effect on your tongue uh, with, because of the effervescence and has a uh, kind of a, a pear uh, flavor to it. It's very well, very good. You can see that it has a nice golden color to it. Another wine that I have here is also from the Avaleda. Avaleda makes some blended wines with uh, wines like with, with grape varieties like Chardonnay. And the one I have here is the blended with Chardonnay. This is from their Foley's collection. The Foley's collection, this one is a 60% Chardonnay. It's a nice, smooth, balanced wine. It's, uh, uh, the Chardonnay is aged in oak barrels. Uh, where the other grape variety is Maria Gomes. So uh, that's an old world grape. It's 60% Chardonnay, 40% of the Maria Gomes grape. This is an excellent, excellent wine. I think you're gonna like this one as well. Serve these well chilled. You're gonna like, love them. They go great with today's meal. The fourth wine here to keep a variety. We have to balance off our, our wine shelf. This is another great white wine from Portugal from a, an area in the south of Portugal. Just south of Lisbon, there's an area of Stubel. And the Fonseca Winery is a major part of the uh, vineyards in the Stubel area. They make some great, great, great red wines. And this is a white wine that they make down there. This is the João Pires. And it, again, it's from the Fonseca Winery in uh, Stubel, Portugal. Actually, the little town of Azeitão. I was there last year, had a terrific meal in a little restaurant in Azeitão and went and toured the, the, the uh, uh, Fonseca Winery. What an excellent, excellent facility there. They produce some great wines. So these wines are all priced under $10 a bottle. You can't go wrong with those prices. There's some great, great wines. They'll fill out your, 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 your wine closet very well. It gives you a nice variety, especially with seafoods, especially in the summertime with some great, great white wines that you can drink on a nice summer day or with this uh, caldeirada or any kind of fish dinner. So go on down, try some out. I know you're gonna love it.